What is important today, we talk about resilience. Resilience about environment, resilience about social. And I think we need to link these two resilience to financial resilience. And it's the combination of the three, the financial resilience, the, the resilience of environment and the resilience of social that will combine together, will create the real value. Today we have a trend to separate each of them. And what will make the real value of uh, an entire project is to combine the three, bring it to value and to make sure that we align the value that we have with the value that we would like to create. The long road about analyzing and understanding what we do have in portfolio and what we do finance, finance with our balance sheet, but also advising to our clients, third parties. So in that respect, what we have to do, it's first of all, making sure that we have a good understanding and a good analysis of the purpose of what we finance or what we would like to advise financing. And after that is to make sure that we do follow up and we do trace and we do measure impact. Measuring impact is becoming one of the decisions that we need to take in finance in addition of the risk return. And risk return is already process that we have already put in place. No measuring impact will be important. It means that we are entering in a dynamic process. Dynamic means that we will have to disinvest some, some activities and this investment needs to be properly organized because if, we, if it's disorganized, it will create systemic risk. And we have on the other side to reinvest in the new opportunities. To disinvest, you need to have a proper risk management. For opportunities, you need to have a proper identification of new area where we would like to invest following criteria of risk return and impact investment.